see the river bank is right here. And this is the old road that we've traveled for a hundred and some years, our forefathers. And now it's gone. And what did we get out of it? Just a few trees and a few logs to keep the mill running for another day. But it's, uh, it's definitely not worth the sacrifice that uh, has been made here. Look at this road. Disgusting. Those are huge pine tree stumps. This used to be part of the old growth forest. Show you what we're coming up to here. Bear with me, it'll only take you another minute here to get through it. See the trees on the right. That's what it's supposed to look like. And the trees on the left. Now we're back down to. River. This is what it's supposed to look like. Some of you might recognize this pool coming up here. We're the vehicles in the summertime. There's Chubb Hall. Someone has to speak up, people. This is this is an injustice that's being done here. It's probably just uh, a bad judgment. Um, uh, I'll give someone the benefit of the doubt that uh, either a forest ranger or an Irving technician or someone decided that they had to cut that little piece of land. Why didn't they leave the roadway? Why didn't they leave that little strip along the river and that little strip along that road? and cut all the thousands and thousands of acres around it, you know, that they've been cutting anyway. Why don't we just leave these little pieces of of uh, New Brunswick's, you know, there's a heritage there and there's, there's a, it's going to be lost forever. Someone has to speak up and put their foot down. This has got to stop. Uh, people are uh, are losing these little pieces of nature and little pieces of New Brunswick that's so important to many, many people. And it's even important to the to the people that run the companies and run the government to talk to them. But uh, then you come today and you find a mess like this on your hands, and it uh, it confirms that the you know the corporate greed and the and the the challenge to fight the deficit is more important than uh, than places like this. So. Uh, Someone has to speak up. I hope that uh, I can encourage everyone that's watching this video to to call your MLA, call whoever you need to, whoever you can find, and and speak your mind about this. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching.